If you like Ava Mendez, you should definitely watch our picks for her best movies. You know, Terry, it was just this primal connection. Mm -hmm. After those three days of non-verbal communication and a whole lot of loving, I had to go to a specialist to get my hips realigned. We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good movie again. Number 10. Once Upon a Time in Mexico, 2003. See anything you like? Once Upon a Time in Mexico is a 2003 contemporary Western action film, written and directed by Robert Rodriguez, and stars Antonio Banderas, Salma Hayek, Johnny Depp, Eva Mendez, and Danny Trejo. In this finish of the classic Mexico trilogy comes one last hell ride following action icon El Mariachi. Making his way across a rugged landscape on the blood trail of a massive cartel kingpin, he soon encounters a variety of helpful, or maybe destructive, figures, including a corrupt FBI agent. This is the beginning of one last bloody fight. Number 9. Out of Time, 2003. Anne Marie had terminal cancer. Really? Yeah, I think she was trying to keep it quiet. Anything else you could tell us, Dr. Scheider? Out of Time is a mystery thriller film directed by Carl Franklin and stars Denzel Washington, Eva Mendez, and Sanaa Lathan. Fast paced and leaving you on the edge of your seat for its entire runtime straight, Out of Time is an action roller coaster filled with crime bosses, drug wars, and corruption. As a police chief goes through a divorce, he begins an intense affair with another woman. Learning about her cancer, he steals money confiscated from a drug dealer, but he becomes a wanted man. Did she actually tell you she was having an affair? Well, uh, we don't really talk a lot, you know, I mean, we mainly just like what's happening on our stories and stuff like that, but I, I just got the feeling, you know, like sometimes when she'd be on the phone, she would talk real quiet and stuff. And... Whisper. Number eight. The Bad Lieutenant, Port of Call, New Orleans, 2009. Like what? Asshole. Cooperate with me, I'll let you walk out of here. Bad Lieutenant, Port of Call, New Orleans is a crime drama film directed by Werner Herzog and stars Nicolas Cage, Eva Mendez, Jennifer Coolidge, and Val Kilmer. Brought to breathtaking and dangerous life by visionary director Herzog, this thrilling story of murder, insanity, and madness finds a broken man suffering from drug addiction. While the people surrounding him are deeply troubled as well, he must kill the pain to investigate into a series of murders that leaves the city on the edge of a cliff. What happened? I snorted what I thought was coke. It turned out to be heroin. I gotta be at work in an hour. Oh, baby, okay. I'm not alone. We'll just get the coke. I'll get out of here. Number seven. Last night, 2010. Your hand sort of rested against my leg. Was that on purpose? Last Night is a romantic drama film written and directed by Massey Tajuddin and stars Keira Knightley, Sam Worthington, Eva Mendes, and Guillaume Canet. Being married is a difficult thing, and keeping the fire lit for years or even decades is an even harder job. For happily married couple Joanna and Michael, the difficulties grow when a night apart could be their greatest challenge. When Michael goes on a business trip with an attractive colleague, his slightly jealous wife meets a former flame of hers. I had to be careful not to really let it rest there. Because she moved. I didn't move. I wouldn't have. Number six. Hitch, 2005. Give me a ring. Sometime. I mean, on the phone. Hitch is a romantic comedy film directed by Andy Tennant and stars Will Smith, Eva Mendes, Kevin James, and Amber Valletta. Starring a once-in-a-lifetime charming Will Smith combined with other comedy legends, Hitch follows self-called best dating doctor on his daily job to help people in their romantic lives. But when falling for a reporter himself, he is forced to realize that his usual tricks don't work on this beautiful woman and that to win her heart, he has to think of something greater. God, you're a morning person, aren't you? <laughs> well, you know, like I uh, 
I always tell my clients, begin each day as if it were on purpose. Number five. The Other Guys, 2010. Hi. Hi. You must be Terry. I'm sorry I've been hiding, honey, but this dinner was tricky. Oof. Who are you? The Other Guys is a buddy cop action comedy film directed by Adam McKay and stars Will Ferrell, Mark Wahlberg, Michael Keaton, Eva Mendez, Samuel L. Jackson, and Dwayne Johnson. Relying on a known but extremely effective comedic theme, The Other Guys follows two desk-bound agents bored to death by their paperwork jobs. Unlike their heroic companions, they have nothing to do at all. But when a minor mission turns out to be a big deal, the two finally get the chance to prove themselves to their agency. And then I show them my breasts and I say, these, these are waiting for you when right. you get back home. You know, Terry, they're, they're not the biggest breasts he's ever seen, but man, are they not, not by a long shot. perky, and they are firm, and they are yours. You're a nice lady. Number four. We Own the Night, 2007. I got good news. Yeah? So I, um, I talked to my mom yesterday, and she's feeling better, so I can move in whenever I want. We Own the Night is an action thriller film written and directed by James Gray and stars Joaquin Phoenix, Mark Wahlberg, Eva Mendes, and Robert Duvall. Led by the vision of a mastermind director and packed with a cast to mobilize fans, We Own the Night is a story of gang wars, drugs, a criminal underworld, and in the middle of it all, a nightclub owner. While his nightclub is often frequented by gangsters, he tries to remain neutral in a police mob war, hiding a fatal secret. His whole family are cops. Bobby, you in there with the mother? Bobby. Uh, Jumbo. <laughs> I'll be on in a second, Jumbo. You gotta come out here. There's tricks. They're, they're dancing naked right in the bar in the lobby. Sweet. Unbelievable. Oh, go. Wow. Go. Number three. Holy Motors, 2012. I grew up here. I grew up in the houses. Holy Motors is a fantasy drama film written and directed by Leos Carax and stars Dennis Levant, Edith Scobe, Eva Mendes, and Kylie Minogue. Inviting the audience on a visually dazzling adventure defined by a thoughtfully challenging narrative, Holy Motors follows a mysterious man with a shadowy past who is driven around by a loyal driver in Paris. Again and again dressing up in bizarre costumes, he intuitively takes on semi-scripted roles without a warning resulting in an abstract, yet jaw-dropping, modern tale. Number 2 Fast Five, 2011 You need to look at that. Fast Five is a heist action film directed by Justin Lin and stars Vin Diesel, Paul Walker, Jordana Brewster, Tyrese Gibson, Eva Mendes, Ludacris, Song Kang, and Dwayne Johnson. Driving the fan-favorite franchise into new territory, Fast Five is the fifth installment that introduced heat-like crime action into the fast racing. To no one's surprise, it works perfectly. When the team is hunted by a new and seemingly unstoppable one-man army, they are forced to come up with better skills, better tricks, and better driving. Berlin, 3 a.m. this morning. A team of drivers hijacked a military convoy. Toretto? Nope. Ain't interested. Yes, you are. Keep looking. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. Custom agents sure are getting pretty, aren't they? Put her on the boat. Let's go. Get on the boat. <laughs> you guys are gonna love it here at the start. I've been here like two and a half years, and hey, you guys are stuck together, and I still love it here. We're like one big happy fam. So, uh, so where'd you get this done? New guy, Jake. Hi. Uh, Nice, nice to meet, meet you. you. Come in. Welcome to my house. Yeah, yeah. 
The Place Beyond the Pines is a neo-noir crime drama film directed by Derek Cianfrance and stars Ryan Gosling, Bradley Cooper, Eva Mendez, Ray Liotta, Ben Mendelsohn, and Rose Byrne. Feeling honest without ever leaning too much on a documentary style, The Place Beyond the Pines is an episodic film about friendship, parenthood, and the daily struggles of life for the ones who had bad luck. Following two unique fathers and later their children, we witness how time leaves its mark and how family can reunite or break with it. Why can't he have that? It's not like he can't have it, he just hasn't had it. Can I give it to him? Wanna give him ice cream? Yeah. I'm gonna do something with him that's his first time. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular movie in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.